going green and saving, the opportunity has been presented to government to reduce the country's energy bill. TC makes it a double after 16 years as a Calypsonian. And in sports, the Sheriff speeds up to his second consecutive tarmac title. Credible. Balanced. Committed. This is the CBC Evening News. Good evening, I'm Pearson Bowen with the CBC Evening News. We begin tonight with a story about an opportunity for Barbados to reduce its high energy bill, aggravated by the fluctuating price of oil on the international market. A Barbadian company, Going Green Technologies Incorporated, is introducing a wide range of solar lighting to the local market. It's a chance for government and the private sector to cooperate in this venture, as Mike Goddard reports. Representatives of both public and private sectors were this morning given a demonstration of the new technology. Jonathan Robbins, sales manager of Solar Paths and Solutions, which is partnering with the local company, says his company is offering Barbados a wide range of lighting solutions, including street lights. I first mentioned the overhead light, but we also have ground lights. Traditionally, street marking has been done with reflectors and lines, so we have active lights that you can put along the roadway, much more effective in terms of guiding drivers. You can literally shut your lights off and drive down the road, though I don't recommend it. Uh, we also have decorative lights. Decorative lighting is always expensive on a project, so this takes it from a luxury to a value added on any project. You could do lighting on surround, beautification, up on the walls, inside pools, it's submersible, so lighting designers and architects have been pretty excited about it. Director of Going Green Technologies Incorporated, Joseph Kelman, says the company will be marketing the solar lights to government and the private sector. We are first hoping that the, the government would be interested in, in using these lights, street lighting, car parks, industrial places. These are the, uh, uh, as well as using the household, uh, the private sector uh, for their yards, for their houses, for anything that um, can go green. Solar Paths and Solutions says it has installed this type of solar lighting around the world and believes the technology is ideal for Barbados and the Caribbean. Mike Goddard, CBC News.